In the realm of gaming, strategy games stand as a testament to the intricacies of planning, decision making, and skillful execution. So prepare to outwit your opponents and grab a G502X Plus gaming mouse to help you guide your civilization to victory. Here are some great strategy games you can play in 2023. Starting off strong with the latest installment of the award-winning franchise, Civilization VI is an epic journey through history and a testament to Sid Meier's visionary game design. Players assume the role of a civilization leader and aim to achieve one of the five victory conditions before anyone else in order to win. There have been a number of updates to the series in this edition, including city districts, a brand new art style, and the other leaders will all be pursuing their own historically accurate agenda, so keep an eye on them. Battle with the world's greatest leaders throughout history to establish your empire. Will your civilization survive? XCOM, the extraterrestrial combat unit, is meant to protect the Earth from alien invasion. But they haven't done a very good job, because in this game, the aliens have been in charge of Earth for two decades. Oops. Luckily, there's still an XCOM guerrilla force trying to take back control and you'll be in charge. Command a squad of handcrafted soldiers from your mobile headquarters, the Avenger. Like its predecessor, XCOM 2 employs a permadeath system, so when your decisions lead to a soldier's death, they're really gone, which is extra sad since you'll start to bond with some of them. So try to prevent as many of them from dying as possible, and finally defeat these alien invaders once and for all. Welcome back to the third installment of the Total War Warhammer series that brings the beloved tabletop game to life. Manage settlements and move armies around the map during your campaign, which will be unique in every playthrough. The base game comes with seven playable factions to choose from, and each have their own pros and cons to consider. Grand Cathay provides an initial safe area, nice for new players, but it's more suited for defense. On the other hand, Exiles of Corn have the very effective Bloodhost armies, but they need to be constantly fighting or they'll die. Bit of a double-edged sword on that one. Whether you prefer diplomacy or all-out war, it's up to you to decide how you'll conquer this world. Time for a throwback with the remastered Command & Conquer, a 90s classic that defined the RTS genre. Now you can command your armies with updated 4K graphics and upscaled cinematic footage, making it much easier to distinguish between infantry units at a glance. You can even jump back to the original graphics with a click if you really want to step back in time. All EVA voice lines and game music have been re-recorded too. And watch as my netrunners dance through the web of cyberspace. And they've included four hours of B-roll footage and making of photos for the big CNC fans. Once again, it's time to pick your side in the battle over Tiberium. Over and out. If you are detected, you fail. If you fail, you die. Welcome to Auriga, a dying planet with a history of apocalypses. Not ideal. After surviving a particularly brutal winter, you must take your chosen faction and expand into the unknown. It'll also be up to you to figure out how to stop Auriga from dying, figuratively carrying the world on your shoulders. The beautiful, randomized maps consist of regions, diversifying endless legend from other 4X games. Once a city is established, the whole region is yours. Of course, it's not as easy as it sounds. There are 11 other major factions also fighting for survival, but not everything has to be solved with a fight. Though, as the seasons change and winter arrives again, fighting might be the only way to ensure your faction's survival. Forge your empires, shape destinies, and unravel the mysteries of this fantastical world. For nothing is immortal, and one day, they may have to survive without me. Ah, the Middle Ages, a fascinating time period to many. If you're one of those people, then this is the strategy game for you. Crusader Kings 3 has expanded on all the things that makes the series great, while also fixing a few of the minor issues, such as simplifying the UI. Rather than running an empire from a removed perspective, you'll be fully immersed in the drama as you roleplay as each member of your dynasty as they scheme and bicker with other nations. Sure, you can fight your way to the top too, but it's way more interesting to topple your enemies from the inside. Even if you don't have a cunning plan in mind and just want to live your life, you'll still find yourself buried up to your neck in noble drama. Where do they find the time? Now let's jump forward a few centuries and take over space. A very simple task, I'm sure. If you love a sandbox game, oh boy are you in for a treat. Fight or ally with alien species while traversing the seemingly endless galaxy, discovering planets and anomalies along the way. 
really putting the grand in grand strategy. There's a lot to do outside of interstellar warfare. Discover treasures guarded by leviathan entities, survive crisis events like an AI rebellion, or explore the ruins of ancient civilizations. Plus there's free rolling updates. So, like your empire, the fun is ever expanding. My task will be to assist and advise you as we venture beyond the safety of our homeworld for the first time in history. So, there are seven strategy games to help you build your grand empire. Leave your thoughts in the comments below. If you enjoyed it, like the video and subscribe to the Logitech G channel for more videos just like this one.